Wrestling Rampage here, back with another video. We are back with another video. I'm Joey. I'm Tommy. We are Wrestle Rampage, and uh, make sure you like us on Facebook, facebookcom Rampage 2 Follow us on Twitter at Russell Rampage, and hit that subscribe button because we have other great video content coming to you guys. Right now, we're gonna do five questions with Wrestling Rampage. Um, these uh, questions are submitted by you guys, the viewers of Wrestling Rampage, uh, our friends here at Wrestle uh, that uh, have subscribed to Wrestling Rampage. Make sure that if you guys do want to ask us, ask us some questions, and uh, we will put them on uh, our uh, five questions with Wrestling Rampage. Send them to our uh, Twitter and our Facebook. Uh, it doesn't matter if it's direct message or not. You can do them as comments. Uh, uh, you can tweet us. Uh, and let us know in the comments below uh, if there's any questions that you guys want to ask us. Um, with that being said, we'll get started. First question is, what is the worst match of all time? And uh, I'll have to say, uh, it's a TNA match. Shocker. Uh, Charmel versus Jenna at uh, Victory Road of 2009. It's god-awful. Uh, you can watch it, uh, fake ass slaps and fake ass hits. The only good part was seeing Gina, uh, come into the ring and, uh, her, uh, shake her ass when she was, uh, uh, pinning Charmel. That was the only good part about that match. Uh, yours? It's TNA match, of course. <laughs> uh, we don't really, we're not a big fan of TNA at all. Uh, Victory Road 2011 is when Jeff Hardy was on drugs <laughs> and he took on Sting. I remember this. <laughs> You know, match only lasts about a minute. <laughs> what do you do? He was fucking throwing... entrances last longer than fucking music. Uh, what you was... see Jeff Hardy peeled out of his mind. <laughs> what, what was trying to throw his shirt? comes out there. It sounded like he was telling Steve, "We're making this a quickie." <laughs> and he was trying to throw his shirt out, and what happened? He got he got a fucking uh, hit uh, with yeah. the Scorpion Dead Drop. It was over. <laughs> yeah, that was it. And that was your TNA World Heavyweight Championship match. Yeah. For Victory Road 2011. Uh, and and that and you picked a better one than I, <laughs> than I did. It was the shit. But uh, next question. At WrestleMania, would you rather ha uh, would you rather see the Money in the Bank uh, match at WrestleMania or the Andre Memorial Battle Royal? Uh, uh, as you guys know, like back in uh, WrestleMania 21 and... Uh, yeah, 21 was the first ever uh, Money in the Bank, I believe. Yes. And, uh, you know, at that point, you know, you had the contract year uh, until the other Wrestle until the next WrestleMania. You got to turn in your Money in the Bank uh, briefcase. Uh, then later on, you know, they started the Andre Memorial Battle Royal. Hmm. What do you think about that? I prefer the Andre the Job Memorial Battle Royal. Here's the reason. So everyone could be on the card at WrestleMania. That is true. Well, they always had a battle royal at WrestleMania. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think what it does is, uh, with the money in the bank, it takes a lot of the mid-carders out of the matches. Yeah. And they'll put them all in one match. But I'm just one. saying, the battle royal is a lot better. Everyone's on the card at WrestleMania. Yeah. And then you have the money in the bank, you know, the money in the uh, money in the bank uh, pay-per-view. Uh, yeah, you know, you're not gonna have money in the bank match if you already had it at WrestleMania. Yeah, but I mean, I don't know. I mean, I mean, if you got rid of the pay per view, I mean, it would make sense. Yeah, but, but if you don't get rid of the pay per view, then there's no sense. Stick to the battle royal. Do you think Apollo Cruz is a future WWE World Champion? Uh, yes, he's got it. He's got the potential to be WWE World Champion, but uh, if they're gonna give it to Bobby Lashley, and Bobby Lashley, he was a great athlete and a great. Well, he uh, wasn't WWE amp, Champion. Uh, well, I mean, he was ECW Champion. Well, anyone could be ECW Champion but, in that uh, era. <laughs> but Bobby won. But um, uh, uh, Apollo Cruz is a better athlete. He, uh, he can move. He's got great speed. He's a hell of a talent. But look at WWE's track record with uh, black athletes. You go out to mid card, and uh, I, I'm not I'm not disrespecting people. I'm just saying look look at look at look at WWE's track record with their black athletes. Look at our truth. Look at look at uh, Mark Henry. Look at uh, 
Shelton Benjamin Shelton when he Benjamin. was there. Look, look at MVP. Uh, you know, list I mean, goes on and on. Look at Junkyard Dog. I mean, uh, I'm, I'm hoping that Apollo Crews uh, breaks that mold. Yes. Because uh, he he looks like a guy that could. Yes, he could. Uh, so I'm 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 looking forward to him. I'm uh, hoping he does. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm I'm hoping maybe maybe he will be a future WWE champion. But we'll, uh, you know, the future is the future. We'll, uh, we'll see how it, uh, how it all folds out. Uh, next question is, uh, how can I support TNA? I don't know how the uh, fuck you can support it. <laughs> uh, how, how, can, how can you what? How can I support TNA? You can't. <laughs> you can't. Unless it's got awful. Unless you like fucking Pudgy Matt Hardy or... Well, I'm sorry, the talent there sucks nowadays. I mean, you have a few you have, gems there. Yeah, but... Yeah, but uh, you they know, don't you use got, it correctly. You know, you got Drew Galloway, but I mean, I mean, Bobby he, Roode, you got, got Austin Roode. Aries, you got, you got fucking uh, all of them guys, but but you don't use them correctly. I don't know how 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 you can support TNA. I don't really, either, uh, and they're on fifty million stations. They they go they change station more than people change underwear. <laughs> but. Uh, I don't. I don't know how you can support TNA. Uh, I don't support TNA. I don't support uh, TNA either. I hate TNA. Ever since Hogan and Bischoff came there, I stopped watching. So I, I don't know. I don't know much about TNA. So then that's the only promotion I really don't give two shits about. Then we got the fifth question. Uh, do you think Charlotte uh, would be better as a heel? Uh, well, she's getting there. Yeah. Well, I mean, I mean, we're, we're soon going to find out. Yeah, because uh, it looks like she's about to turn heel, especially yes. with Ric Flair with her. Yeah, I mean, so, uh, you know, you're going to see Ric Flair. Uh, Ric Flair's uh, doing, you know, pulling her leg onto the ropes and things like that. So, I mean, here soon she will be heel. I mean, th there's no doubt about it. Yeah. Uh, there's no doubt about it with that. So, uh, um, would she work better as a heel? Probably. Uh, uh, I, I think th she'll probably be better as a heel than a face. I mean, this is the thing: is it's always easier to be a heel. It's always easy to have people hate you than to have people like you. Yeah, but sometimes people like you is a heel too. So. You know, look at Stone Cold. Yeah. Uh, you know, sometimes it backfires. You know, Stone Fuck, look at the New Day. They're heels, and then everyone loves them. Uh, Kevin Owens is a heel. Everybody, everybody likes, likes him. Owens. So, you know, you can't force feed a. Babyface, and that's the reason why so so many people rebel. Uh, Roman Reigns, yeah, it's because WWE is trying to force feed uh, him as 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 a, a great babyface, yeah. Uh, and and usually when you try to force feed somebody something, they're not gonna like. It. They're not gonna like it. So. And, and and that's the reason why most people don't really like Roman Reigns. Uh, all here, I don't like Roman Reigns, but I think he's got talent. I ain't gonna take that away from him. It's just I'm just not a fan of him. And uh, that was your five questions with Wrestle Rampage. Make sure if you guys do want to ask us a question, uh, you can uh, ask us at Twitter uh, at Russell Rampage, uh, Facebook.com slash Wrestling Rampage. Uh, you can leave comments, direct messages. Uh, it doesn't matter. We'll get back to you. Trust us. Um, or you now, can leave comments here on YouTube. Yeah, leave us in the comment below a question if you guys would like to ask, ask us a question there. Um, and, uh, you know, if we don't reply, you know, don't worry. Uh, yeah. Your question will probably be on our on our five questions. Yeah. So, you know, if, if we don't reply to the uh, message, you know, don't dis don't get discouraged. Uh, you just gave us the question, so it probably will be on our, yeah. on our five questions. Um, make sure that you like us on Facebook, facebookcom rampage 2 Follow us on Twitter at Russell Rampage, and hit that subscribe button because we have other great videos coming to you guys. Uh, you guys do not want to miss it. Trust us. Wrestle Rampage is that cream that rises to the top. That's right, the cream of the crop. And nobody does it better. <laughs>